Brad and Vinny. Yeah, Jeff. Jeff and Jeff. Let's enter the kill zone. The kazone. Brought to you by the kazone. Brought to you by Pizza Hut. Enter the kazoo zone. I don't. What's going on in kill zone? I don't want to get. I don't want to get killed. I don't want to be in that zone. All right. Well, we're we're in the zone. So get ready. This is this is totally gonna occur. We're gonna start in chapter four. This is uh, the the big terrorist attack they've shown at E3. Uh, you know, it's it's a good early part of the game, kind of before the story gets a little too spoilery, and it's got some combat. And you know, people kind of see if you know how it's come along. I guess from yeah, the sure. first time they showed it. Sure. Um, so we've been uh, do, out doing some dirt. The mission before this one has like very little combat. It's a lot of you carrying power generators around and jumping and sure. not great. Uh, but we were trying to get this doctor. We didn't get the doctor. We're a shadow marshal. This lady here is Echo. She's kind of the equivalent for the Hellgast. Um, nice camera angle, kill zone. She's a, she's a Hellgast? Yeah, I mean, you know, if you remember from uh, kill zone lore, nothing. The Vectans and the Hellgasts are were originally all humans. Yeah. Right. And then the Hellgast went off to go do something, and yeah. then, you know, the, the Earth. I think it was one of those like typical like colonists, colonists and then abandoned. Yeah. And then abandoned. They, get really, they get really mad yeah. when they get abandoned. I, they, I, I think that's the story. And they kind of evolved a little bit, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Then so they, they look a little changed. different. Exactly. Yeah. So, uh, uh, is this this is all pre-rendered? This cutscene. I, I yes, I'm gonna say yeah because it's it's doing loading in the background. If we hit the option button here, you see it'll uh, do like resume and skip. Uh, okay. If you if you hit it too early, the skip won't be there. So okay. I, I, what? Oh, I see. What were you doing? Well, yeah, some things went bad at the <laughs> okay. end of chapter three. Huh. All right. Um, okay. Uh, and we're we're heading back home. Hey, some things went bad at the end of so, Kill Zone. So at the end of Kill Zone three, okay. yeah, exactly. Uh, Helgen gets blown up. All those refugees come to your planet. So they built a big Berlin Wall style thing around the entire planet. Oh, it seems reasonable. Yeah, totally. Wait. Uh, so that those refugees could live on the other side of the wall. They gave them half the planet? They gave them half the planet. Like, hey, we blew up your planet. It was kind of a bummer. Okay. We, we agree. You think they felt that guilty about it? I have it? no idea. That seems like a really dumb thing to do. Yeah, but also, seriously. let's build a wall. We really, like, this side hey, of the room is mine, this side like, of the room is yours. If you're trying to eradicate your enemy, I don't know if letting them come live yeah. with you is well, the best Well, they were idea. refugees who, I, you know, yeah, okay. again. I, so some some time has passed. All right. Uh, for, it took time for them to build this wall, so this is just kind of long after the events of that game. Man, this looks really good. Um, I feel like this looks better than when they first showed it. Well, that's what happens when you work on games. I guess. Right? Um, Hopefully. Yeah. yeah, it's also weird, because you and I played this game at, uh, at Sony HQ. Uh, like two, three weeks ago? Yeah. All right, I'm now in control of the game, in case this wasn't, yep. this yep. jerky movement didn't make it obvious. But now, like right now, we are sitting on our couch in the studio looking at this game as if we were in a living room. Uh huh. Like seeing it from a distance on a t big TV like you would at home. Yeah. Like really drives looks home. Nice. How, yeah, how good this looks. Like we were right up in front of, like two feet away from TVs at Sony playing this, but. Take it yeah, back. I think it back and taking it all in is what I'm I wonder, saying. I wonder if that's going to be the story of these consoles. If you get too close to these screens and stare at them, you're going you're to pick it apart yeah. and like, all I that stuff. But I didn't think it looked that great when we played it there, like with our faces jammed up against the screen. But look at how tall we must be. Uh, you mean how short? Yes. This well, has this has bugged me about Kill Zone since I, I remember it from two. I don't know if it was in the first one, but you're never tall enough in these games. Your eyesight, That's, it, it, your line of sight is always at like chest ev level. Every single shooter is that way. I think Killzone is egregious about it. Whoa. Eyes it's here, always man. bugged the shit out of me. Hey, what's going on up there? <laughs> maybe maybe they have, maybe there's some like cinematic reason for the way they've got the... That's us! I don't know, maybe you're just That's really you? Short. That's me! All right, look at a tough guy. <laughs> maybe it's like Hollywood. Maybe every Killzone hero is just super short. But he's got a really big head. Yep. He just stands on phone books during cutscenes? Yeah. Oh, this is going to be awesome. This is beautiful. Chancellor this Vasari made cool. another provocative no. statement earlier today in response to the as yet unexplained event that left Vinny dead. Wait, what? Left who dead? I'm sorry, what? Did you say left Vinny dead? Yeah, Vinny's dead. <laughs> what happened? Shit, man. You weren't supposed to find out. Sorry. Whoa. Oh. Rezo gun. <laughs> they shot the Rezo gun. Rezo gun takes place in the Killzone universe. Oh, man. This is what's inside the ring. Yeah. It's just kill zone <laughs> happening in there. Yes, I, this looks familiar now. Yeah. yeah. Remember this? I yeah. think they showed this uh, the day of the system announcement. Yeah, this, I think the first time they showed the game, it was this stuff. Right. So. 
campaign's been kind of uneven so far. Yeah. You know, it, it's uh, it feels like a game where they just didn't put enough game in it, where they've got these kind of big open areas and there's the promise of these environments and stuff. But in a lot of cases, it's just like there's not a lot to do yeah. other than go do the objectives. It's That's, yeah, that was kind of the impression I got of it from playing it. Yeah. Whoa. A couple, a couple Wait weeks a ago. minute. Whoa. What? Who's that guy? You should, oh. he's, he's, he is a bad guy. Have you seen he's these guys before? He's a hell dude. Um, yeah, I watched you play in that mission you were talking about where you're like carrying the energy sources around. Yeah. Not a whole lot to that. Let's send out our owl. Okay. That's pretty cool. That's, That's our new. little dude. That's new. What did that do? Uh, he's, he's out there shooting people. Well, we're back here hiding. Now he's coming back because he got rocked. Uh, so can he be killed? Uh, no, he, he can be... Uh... Are you missing a barrel on your gun? That fall off at well, some point? It looks like a rail gun or something. Yeah, so I can I can actually hit down on the D-pad okay. and go like that. And then it's a sniper weapon. Yeah. This is kind of your, your universal weapon. You also have a secondary. Um, looks like they made the aiming faster. Can that primary weapon you're holding there, can that thing actually be dropped? No. You, you have to keep that, right? There are story sequences where you no longer have it. Right. But, but you can't lose that for two other guns, right? Right. Okay. I, yeah, I, I'm pretty sure that's the case. Hey, Drew, can I get a little less big knob? Yeah. Yeah, there you go. All right. Sorry, I was just, uh, just losing some of the finer detail here. Send our dudes out. So how are you sending that owl out? Uh, it's L1. OK. Uh, and it'll uh, basically cast its active ability. You can use the touch screen here to set what the abilities are. So, so what do you got? Or the, the, the touch screen, the touch pad. Like that's attack at the top. So it's attack at the top. That's a zip line on, okay. the, on the right uh, for, you know, if you want to get somewhere low. Uh -oh. All right, we got don't, damn it, Hellgast. I'm trying to give a demo over here. Uh, down is a shield, like a deployable shield here, so we can... Okay. Get that. And I can hold down L1 to call it back. Right. Okay. Well, and then, uh... One on the left is like... The left is like a shock. Hack? Oh, okay. Uh, and it, it'll be context sensitive. So if okay. I'm pointing at a, at a computer or something that can be hacked, yeah. it will become a hack icon. Okay, that's what I saw of it. So what, it'll shock a guy if you use it on a guy? Let's find out. Shocker guy. Do it. Uh, does the shield run out at some point? Yeah. Zap that fool. All right, that's kind of neat. Does everybody have an owl? Uh, not everybody. Because you're a shadow marshal. Yeah. Shadow marshals have owls? Will you get the owl. Uh, I can also hit right on the D-pad to send out this pulse, and it'll paint uh, enemies Ooh. in that pulse. Uh, but you have to let off before it fills up, otherwise it lets it alerts them to your presence. Mm. Wait, hang so, on. Say it again? If I hold this right, if I hold right on the D-pad too long, uh -huh. and it goes out too far, uh -huh. they know I'm doing this, okay. and they come to kill me. Okay. That's, that, can, that's, that's the meter at the bottom? Yeah. Can you actually use that to your advantage, and just like, like kind of make them come like, through, all yeah, come like through a door? Funnel them through a choke point or something? Uh, let's let's hold it down too long and see what happens. Well, this is a bad spot. That's a oh, yeah, they didn't like that. They just turned around. Yeah, a couple oh, so guys are like, gonna, "What's going on over there? So We're too far. We're probably a little too far away." They're just gonna open up on you. Uh, so is your owl like an owl, or is it like just a, it's a droid? Drone. Okay, it's not like Jason and the Argonauts no. style. Oh jeez. Ah, uh, so gotta like get back. Gotta get back. I assume you could still go into cover and put your gun over and all the covering mechanics. Yeah, and... yeah. I mean, I was doing a little bit of that back here, actually. I mean, it's, uh, yeah, I can, you know, if I get low here, he'll hold up and then it's boop, yeah. boop, 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 like that. Just like that. There is a big gun guy somewhere, and maybe, the, maybe it was this dude over here. Oh, there's a... Drone, go be a drone. <laughs> Owl stand for something? Probably. Let's go knife those guys. It's not really an option right now. Man. Whoa. Oh, seeing the owl got 
uh, beaten. So normally when you go down, uh, you have adrenaline packs uh, that you can use. And normally when you go down, you can use the owl, have the owl use one of your adrenaline packs to pick you back up. But if the owl is out there uh, fighting, no, if it, if it has been beaten and it needs to come back and recharge, oh. it won't be able to help you. Also, you'll run out of adrenaline packs. Oh, okay. There's the guy with the good gun. That guy? You take his big gun? Yeah. It's a big gun. I suspect this is how this encounter was supposed to go. Uh, get this big gun. <laughs> yeah, and use so it. Mow down these guys. That guy have a sword? No, it's no. a glowy gun. The sniper up there is just the lighting. Okay, so you see that we completed an objective. Plaza secured, and we can kind of hold up on the D-pad and kind of see what we're doing next. Um, you can tab up on the D-pad to show like your objectives. And sometimes you have more than more than one. Or some optional objectives. I need to op not optionally get back. Why am I not? Get over there. Come on. This guy. No. Oh. Oh, no. All right. So he'll hang out here for a little bit, and I can hit L1 and be like, hey, buddy. Those adrenaline packs are finite. You have to find yeah, more. Yeah, you have of those. to find more. Even you have to hit a button to pick them oh, up. It's not even. Oh, that's man. You were just striding forth with impunity. Oh, well, wow. it, adrenaline has its benefits. It's not so much with this weapon, but uh, if you you can use an adrenaline pack at any point, okay. and it will recover your health and also give you a slow motion bonus. Ah. So like uh, you know, whenever you aim down the sights, it'll slow the action down for a little bit. I like when your barrels get hot and they turn yeah. red. Yep, that's cool. Thank you. I like that. Ah, there's guys behind you. That's, oh, the turning is so slow with this oh big gun. Oh my god. I say drop the gun. Oh god. Oh, well, <laughs> owl. Man. Great. Mm, terrific. Can the owl not revive you from that? That was a fall, so. That's... Jeez, pretty generous with the checkpoints, I guess. Uh, when you hit him, you hit him. Yeah, yeah. it's uh. Even if you're in fire? <laughs> uh, I haven't had any checkpoints go bad. Oh, whoa! What the Jesus, fuck man. happened there? The owl eventually. I crashed through this, the glass there. Yeah, I guess. it seemed like they shoot it out. Maybe. I, whoa. Oh, hey, oh, man. Oh. Come on. Oh. I was trying to knife him, but I guess like, with this big gun, I can't. <laughs> I think I you've got to get rid of that gun. I can't do the melee kills while I've got the gun. I think that gun is. Uh, uh, I've been through this encounter before, so. Right. I'm going to keep the gun? <laughs> Hey, lay, lay off, Brad. All right. Man, you just, know what I think? Some help, I think, advice. <laughs> I think you should stop playing and just send in a bunch of owls. You just go sit back down in a trailer somewhere and make more owls. Oh. Those, things, those things seem to be doing all right. <laughs> oh, man. Come, Come on. on. Come on. <laughs> all right. See? <laughs> At least let me burn through all the ammo on this stupid thing. That thing is dumb. Uh, a lot of guys with flashlights kind of shining them at you. Lighting seems like a big part of this game's, uh, you know, graphics package. Fuck, man. Uh, These guys are in here. Where are they? Yeah, where, where are you getting peppered from? Uh, from the other side of the glass. Give Those barrels give them, blow up. Give them a quick pulse. There you go. Uh-oh. Man, fuck that guy. How's your sidearm? <sighs> you like it at all? No, it's pistol. Is it, is it kind of weak? No, I'm gonna I'm gonna pick up something else here, like the Kaiser here. Whoa! Uh, you'll find I... different versions of some of the enemy Whoa. weapons. I like that one. along the way. I use that one at Sony. Uh, that'll have uh, you know ACOG sights or you know uh, underbarrel attachments, that sort of stuff. Are those real reflections in the scope or are those faked? Uh, those Can't are tell. real. I think that's real. Yeah, that's real. I think so. Huh? Huh? Come on, man. I would hope, but you never. You can't really refer, if you can't refract the real environment at yeah. this point on. Just go home. New machines. I don't know. I'm not seeing. It. I think. I think it's fake. Well, it's very dark. At least here. on your first party games. Yeah. All seriously. right. So here's here's so, basically, as soon as we point at that thing, it goes like, this is a thing you can hack. See that? Oh, it's changing. See. So it's contextual. So okay. I hit all one. 
our buddy will go do whatever it needs to do here. Dance, do a little, do some kill zone jumping. Yeah. Rip. Rip. Fine, sir. It's good to hear your voice. I was coming in when the blast went off. Right outside. I think it's fake, Brad. What? Go, go, go. I don't know, man. I'm not really seeing much in there right now. It's the odd reflected light. Mm. Yeah. I mean, it might be faked in, in the sense that it's like some kind of environment map mm. and not actually the real environment. I don't know. Yeah. I wouldn't blame them for faking it. That seems like a waste of resources to yeah. put an actual scope reflection on I don't on know. It. I hear the PS4 is reasonably powerful. I, yeah, that's, that's just the sort of because we can sort of thing you would do for a launch game, even if it didn't necessarily mm -hmm. benefit the game, but... I don't know. Also, I, I mean, I feel like one way or the other. I, I feel know. like that that happened last generation too. Yeah. I don't feel like having that is a new thing. So that's not glass I can break. So. It sounds like glass you break. There is a lot of destructible stuff in this game, though. Oh uh, yeah, like walls um, you can kind of punch through. Yeah. Oh I, yeah, maybe. Oh hi. I think this is one of those areas. I'm not sure. Maybe it is real. I thought it looked different. Anyway, what's wrong with that guy's face? Oh, he's just Nothing. lit. He's lit. Sinclair's outside. He's 40. Shallow. Let's intubate. Give me a 6.52. What's the status on that health? Not 6.52. Come on. Lock off all floor and throw to the tree. Nothing leaves that building. All information and data is locked down. Oh, man. Jesus Christ, that's their temper point. The suits are here. This guy's your dude. Like a handler? Yeah. Are you like, you're like a special forces? Yeah, thing? you're kind of a, a one man, you know, go behind enemy lines, go on the other side of the wall and do dirt. Okay. Kind of guy. I like that the, they're written in the first person up there. It said, I reported to Sinclair. <laughs> this is a little journal he's keeping. Yeah. His diary. And then, <laughs> do you have a name? Like, is there a story around you? Lucas Ke Yes, yeah. The, okay. the, the, yes, Lucas okay. Kellen. You're you not, saw when he checked in. Yeah, exactly. It showed not, right there. But, but, but I mean, you're not a. Uh, well, you are mute. But no, he speaks. Oh, okay. You should tuck your earpiece over your ear. Is that you? Yeah. Yeah. So it's like you know, this is kind of where the Cold War of these two peoples gets hot again. Sir. Ish. Intel confirms it's the black hand. <gasps> the black hand. Not the black hand. Yes, the black hand. No. Yes. Fine. Fine. What exactly did, did, did they do? Did they, was it just a bomb they set off? That seems to be it. Yeah. Or was there but, something more nuanced to it? Uh, there, there. You know, I, I haven't finished the game yet, okay. so maybe there's you know more to it. But just wondering if there was some crazy future tech terrorism going on. Uh, can you do me a favor and call the black hand? Tell him his audio is out of sync. Shh. Just uh. Like eleven frames. Just. <laughs> also, like, why do you have like why does your interference have your logo in it? Like, what do you have hooked up that? Uh, like at that point, it's it's a purely aesthetic effect yeah, that you're going for. He's putting that on. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this guy's like the audio's out of sync. I can't watch this. Yeah, this is terrible. I told them we are at war. Has this guy been looking for a fight for a while? Is that yeah, see, kind of, sort of. So are this coming? Yeah. How long has it been since Killzone 3 came out? It was two years? Two and change? Because it launched and it shipped in like a first quarter, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. Early in a year. I think so. I wonder, I just, I wonder how, how long most of Gorilla has been working on this game. Right, yeah. Um, just thinking back to the launch of the PS3, you know? Like, remember the, the first Killzone 2 trailer? Right. And then there was no Killzone 2 for, like, what, two, three years? Something like that, yeah. Uh, like, the fact that they got, a, like, a full, like, a full complete Killzone out for launch is kind of cool. Even if I'm not, I'm not the hugest Killzone fan. But. Yeah, and I haven't, uh, I haven't been able to try the multiplayer yet. Yeah. Um, the talk is that the multiplayer runs at 60. I, I guess I haven't, really? I haven't seen it at all, huh. so I don't know that's that an, for that's, sure. That's, that's kind that's, of an interesting split. That's what they've been saying, I guess, but... Yeah. Uh, this, is, you know, this is obviously less than that. I'm curious what sacrifices they made to get it running that smooth. Oh! oh! A 
Ooh. right, I forgot. There's You're a train. You're on a train? There's a yeah. train. Wow. There's a train coming to town. That'd be a real... That... You know, that... Jeez. That doesn't necessarily scream tracks. Yeah. <laughs> Considering it's the same color as the walkway right next to it. Well, he did say, hey, they're using trains as missiles and all. Let's get me down on the tracks. But... That's a fast train. It's fast. It's the future. That's... That is... Speed train. Whoa. Speed train. What? Uh, what? <laughs> train clipped you, man. I, Stay seems... behind the yellow line. Train, uh. train kept rolling, man. All right, um, uh, I'm gonna get over and not get hit by this train. They should then... tell the trains to stop. Is oh, there's a guy. There's a guy. I don't think he made it. Yeah, he, he, he did not he make some, it. Some trouble here. He fell victim to whatever it was. The train problems. You should put your owl in front of the train. <laughs> Send him out when the train comes. <laughs> Ah. Oh, no! <laughs> Poor owl. Uh, new... That took all of his health. Gonna need a new owl. Oh, wow, he, he recharges pretty quick, huh? Yeah. Hands, hands, and, hands, and, hands, and, hands, and, hands, and, hands, and. hands, hands. All right, you're off the train. Yeah, for now. Wait, where's that? Oh, oh it's behind you. Where? Oh. Am I missing him? Do you guys see him? No. Oh, oh there right. Uh, how do you like the the sniper attachment for this thing? Is it not? It's not great. Yeah. Uh, it's one of the thing. It's the thing where you charge it up ah, like that. Um. And so it takes a lot of bullets. Oh. You know, it's like uh, one of the things where you're, you're shooting a whole mag in one yeah. shot. Mm -hmm. You also have to. You do have to charge for a couple seconds. Is it like a one hit kill though? Yes. In in. In most cases. All right, where am I? Okay, where am I going? So I can hit up on the D-pad and it'll say, "Here's where you're going." And sometimes I lose the. It's right. Over, it's to your left. It's the slightly. Yeah. yeah. There you go. Okay. Yeah, that is a. Yeah. This is, is a colorblind issue. Yeah, I think, that's not Where great. that doesn't. It's also pretty small. On this it, yeah. Where sometimes that gets lost in the background. You guys, you guys should stop being colorblind. Okay. It seems to cause a lot of problems. Okay. I'm gonna call HR, man. I feel like that's yeah, that's, uh, boy, that's holy kinda shit. Jesus. Jesus. No, I'm just trying to this offer some yeah. helpful Ooh. working advice. It's like you should stop being paralyzed. It's like, yeah. like it's trying to help you do your job better. Uh, could really use you on my volleyball team. <laughs> you know, ask me like, hey, why don't you stop being Irish? Like, uh, <laughs> that help? Because I'm drunk all the time. Is that what you're trying to say? <laughs> well, I wasn't gonna say it, but. Uh. Uh, where's the... Ladders to your left, is that what you need? Oh That's my gosh! Yeah, that was a little yeah. nerve-wracking. Oh, oh, hey! I told you you'd come in here, I told you! Hey, hi. It's another crazy guy. Hey, by guy. the way, I've got a robot. Another crazy guy on the Muni. Yeah. Is this guy still playing his video? Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, it was worth it. That's a really long Slip knife animation. Throat. Yeah, the knife animations. I mean, it, Killzone's always been an animation-heavy oh. game. Yeah. Uh, oh, what's going you. on here? That's uh, just it, because you can sometimes be revived in that right. situation. They, he was waiting. They let it go. Uh, wait, where am I? Okay. This guy's still streaming. Yeah, his live stream still going. <laughs> I'm going to play some Minecraft next. <laughs> yeah. Hi. Uh. This is a bad place to be with no, uh, no adrenaline, also. Uh, since I can't revive myself if I go down, so I need to play a little extra carefully here. Chuck a grenade. You got him. Pop, pop. Bounced oh, off the oh ceiling. Boy. Well, not that, that worked out great. <laughs> yeah. My buddy. So far, I've mostly been using the attack because uh, you know it provides a good distraction, gives yeah. you time to kind of just clean up the mess. But you can shoot through his shield, right? You can shoot yes. out of it. Uh, yes. Seems like that would be pretty good for some of these crowded environments too. Just shield it up. And oh yeah, yeah. But you know me. Yeah. I'd rather shoot dudes <laughs> yeah, than no, I hear you. Get, have dudes get dead instead <laughs> right. of protecting myself. You'd rather stop them from shooting you by shooting them. Yeah. 
I'm not sure how this subway works. Not a lot of seats. This is their standard like, train. It's, it yeah, like, it's like a standard train. Yeah. Oh, so I gotta. Yeah, so I can't even interact with that myself. I am too stupid to use that machine. <laughs> too, stupid, too stupid? Just point at the computer and go, do or, 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 yeah, or maybe, proud, man. Or maybe just, we'll all get there. This yeah. is what iPhone smartphones end up with. We don't know how to do anything. Uh oh. If you look to your left, look to your left a little more. <gasps> What's that? Somebody left a package in that seat. See something, say something, man. <laughs> oh, man. There you go. You get a trophy. Make sure you break all the screens. Break all the TVs in the, in the broadcast station. Uh-oh. Oh, I think yeah. they have drones, too. Are those bad owls? They don't even have masters. That's how bad they are. Oh, hello. Yep. What you have to do? Regain control of the train? Yeah, so there, there are three trains that have been taken over, so I kind of need to just... What a mess. Yeah, the commute's gone really fucking poorly this morning. Uh, are you backtracking or did you get... Oh! oh no, he'll, he, it automatically grabs ledges, so... I knew that was going to be the... Oh, God. Damn it. It was too hot and I was, it was taking too long for me to jump back on the train. Uh, do you have any other missions opened up that would be worth jumping into? Too hot. Or do you want to just keep pushing forward with this? Uh, this this looks like this. This is more train stuff for a while. So yeah, yeah maybe we can uh, go into a different section here. I'll show you like a larger uh, city area. I think. Uh, select chapter. So let's do that's four. Let's go into five. The Hellgast. You owe me. Yes, yeah, so this will be kind of a, uh -oh. a quieter area here. Is this Rico? You owe me. I'm no. back. Speak, no. speak not his name. <laughs> I don't even remember what happened to Rico. I'm not sure what, what state the world is yeah, in. I, I don't remember either. Uh, so this, is, this takes place on the other side of the wall. We're trying to get over there. That guy that was on that TV screen. Yes. He's got to go. Yeah. He's a bad guy. <laughs> so... <laughs> Uh, and this this whole thing takes place, like you said, they after the events of the last kills, and this, this is, is years and years. This is years like a years. good couple yeah. of decades, I believe. At least, yeah. Um, you are playing an installed version of this game, correct? Yep. Or a digital version, I should say. Yes. Like this, a, is, this a, is off of a hard drive, like a PlayStation Store style <laughs> hard drive only. Controller do a lot of rumbling. Well, you know, you shoot the gun. Kind of normal. Yeah, you know. does what it needs to do. Uh, I believe you have just, if I remember this part, you we have just EMP'd this yes, train. Yes, just set off a bomb on this train. Uh, this is this is where we go from like being someone who is, oh, we're just uh, heading into, just crossing over into enemy and territory, now, so and now all of a sudden it's like, it's hey, by the way, I had my gun with me the whole time. <laughs> I don't know how that works. You're a RoboCop hey, gun. Man. Yeah, because you went through a security checkpoint to get here. Yeah. Uh, you were with a group of Vectons. Is that right? Uh, a group of Helgens who are like refugees that oh. are being returned. Oh, the, oh, those were all Helgens you were with. Um, I believe yeah, is the Helgas. Yeah. I don't know. I got one. We'll update. One eight out. Yeah, these uh, these environments. I feel like this is something I've said for some of the other stuff I've seen. Dense. Yeah. There's a density in the... Yeah, the like, uh, you know, I, I've played the sequence, uh, you know, a, a few weeks ago and got lost. Hmm. <laughs> uh, in, in it was like, area? you know, they, they, show you, they show you where the, you know, the main objectives are, but they don't really, you know, Your path. that's not the next turn yeah. in the path. That's just get there. Yeah. yeah. And uh, I, some, I, of these, some of these environments get yeah. a little thick. So. I, I got lost in the park coming up here, too. Um, all right, so let's uh, let's shoot a guy. What? Not that guy. No, now who's a terrorist? There is no sneaking option here, right? You have to fight your way through this. I'm guessing. Yeah. I mean, you know, you, you, there are, are definitely spots where you can kind of sneak around a little bit more. Because yeah, the, that's that's the thing that struck me about the level design in this area is that there are some you know air ducts and kind of alternate paths. Yeah, like you can get behind guys and melee kill and, and stuff like that. There are definitely spots where you can you can get through. Uh, but I don't know that you could do like a stealth only yeah. playthrough of this level. Is that ammo blinking over to uh, your right on that thing? Uh, it could be uh, collectible. Mm. 
So that's an alarm over there that's going off, so I'm gonna set off the alarm. I can hack it to uh, shut it down. Yeah, it's a long, long distance hack. What about that might, do? Uh, That'll stop the reinforcements from coming. A lot of floating paper this generation. Uh, yeah. A lot of debris. Yeah, a lot of debris. A lot of dust motes in, in the sun. In the light, yeah. In the sunbeam. Yeah. All right. Sparks. Just yeah, a whole lot of sparks. Particle effects for days. <laughs> Next gen. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Should have raised your shield that much. Fatal time. flaw in your <laughs> shield design, guys. <laughs> shield, yeah. <laughs> Maybe put a piece of plexiglass there next time. <laughs> what kind of gun did he drop? Shotgun, probably. A sickle? That's a weird sight. <laughs> Alright, where are we going? We're going over here, right? Yeah. Yes. Going there. I remember this part. I can't aim or shoot while I'm sliding. I wish I could. Oh, you can't even shoot? No. Uh, you just, can you, do you actually like drop kick a dude? Control. Target location under fire. Uh oh. Just drop Wait, is that he still, guy. he's still up? You know, he's not getting up, but he's not dead. Could he pull his piece on you? I haven't had that happen. Go back to some, oop. Quake style, get that last yeah, shot yeah. off. All right. Oh, I think he's done. Yeah. I'm gonna get rid of the shotgun. Uh, yep. So it'll it'll highlight uh, vents and some other thing, adrenaline packs and stuff like that that you can pick up. That's cool. That seems useful. That little like radar burst. Yeah. He's not here. We're looking for a guy who's gonna point us in the direction of uh, the bad guy, Tyrion, the bad guy. Uh, like a contact, kind of yeah. an informant. Stupid computer. I hate computers. There's ammo over here. There's a collectible here, but I already collected it. Mm. Oh, your husband, whatever. Everybody's somebody's husband. Oh, not everybody. You got a, a, a lean on the wall or anything? No. Okay. The lean? No, not that I've seen. Hmm. Oh. That guy's had enough, I guess. He's like, whatever. Sounds like, sounds like there's one of those big guns around. Uh, that gun is coming off of my owl. Oh, that really? Yeah. Okay. I'm already full of adrenaline packs, but that's what they look like. Hmm. Blister pack. Yeah. Even in the future. Future pharmacy. Wait, am I? Am I doing it again? Am I getting lost again? Is this what happened last time? I think yes. this might be what happened last time. Uh, there's a double set of double doors kind of over the direction you're facing, I believe. Yeah. That leads to a new area. Oh, the other way. Run around here this way and go down. Uh, I still think it's the other way. And then go that way. Okay. Our thoughts right. go out to Vector. <laughs> oh. I going up the stairs. That the stairs are just one up. Yeah. Looking over here real quick first. All right, go back up here. 
Turn to the left. This, turn. Is, this is out the way we came. Keep turning to the left. Or keep turning to the left. Go this way again. Go generally that direction and keep going that way. Uh, there's definitely uh, kind of more to your left. Oh, oh you went too far. <laughs> I'm going to go towards the thing. Uh, all right. Your funeral, man. There is definitely another part of this complex that you can get into over that way. Uh, that leads to some air ducts. Yeah. But it might just be one of many paths, like I said. It seems like they're maybe giving you some options about how you approach the objectives. This area. What's he got on you? What's his plan? He's got to have something, right? You hear? What? You think you're special? Uh, didn't you know? I'm special too, man. We all are. Cut the shit. Where is he? Hey, easy. <coughs> Come here. You see that tower? The boy Terrence holed up at the bottom. You need to take a container down into the canyon. <coughs> I'm telling you. It's messed up down there. Go in, you're not getting out. So here's an example of a, an optional objective. There's a tracking database up at that platform. If you destroy it, I might have a chance to get away. You owe me. I'll see what I can See? There's two. Press and hold to view. Take what you want. You get stuff out of doing secondaries? Uh, no. We just located that missing control. Okay. Then fuck it. I mean, there may be story stuff that changes. I, I don't know. Stay alert. But there was no immediate. I, I've done this hey, mission hey, before. Hey, there was hey, no immediate. Hey, like, shoot, shoot that fire extinguisher. All right. Take my mic off. Yeah. <laughs> You're done. What, what generation are we in here? Uh, <laughs> Is this a SNES game? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, uh, I don't know. You, I don't know if you know this about uh, fire extinguishers in the future. They run on different stuff. It's totally different stuff. <laughs> they're, they're also they're pretty sturdy. Yeah. Also very sturdy. You shoot them a few times, like five or six. Wait, wait, wait. That did not go. <laughs> Took that guy a second to decide if he was gonna fall down or not. I think he was getting back up. How is the AI in this? Because these guys are just kind of standing there letting you grenade them. It's not great. No. Uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, I've seen dudes just like running in place up against stuff before, like this. Yeah. You know, it, it's it's mm. not outstanding. Is that guy all right? I may have killed a civilian here. Yeah, that's probably on me. Well, that was a hell gas. Who cares? That is a big part of what the story seems to be dealing with. <laughs> yeah. Let this serve as a lesson to us all that we are answerable for our actions. We must live with their consequences. Mm-hmm. Whoa. Oh, oh, geez, man. Poor guy. Oh. No jibs in this game, huh? No, not really. So the optional objective, we can go across the street here, across the tracks. So there's like a fast way to do this. I'm not sure if I can make it through unscathed, but we're going to find out. Go, 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 go. And then that thing pops up and starts shooting at you, but I need to get this vent. Oh. oh boy. All okay. right. All right. Seems like a fast way to do this. Uh, whereas if you have to run around, it you know it takes a little bit of time. But we're going to pop up kind of behind some of these guys here. And, uh, you know, we'll have a couple of seconds of shooting time before they uh, 
where they know what's up. Oh, this is uh, totally the area I was talking about with the double doors. But you took a completely different way of getting here mm. than I did when I played this. Oh, did they, they get alerted to you? They must have. They heard that guy get stabbed. You got a grenade so you can bank around that? I got some C4. But they're not so interested as to walk around the corner. Oh. Well, now that you took that out. Yep, they heard the C4 being Weird. held. That's, that's not great. Well, got you right. In all seriousness, I hope that stuff like AI is something that people start working on with these consoles, right? Yeah, you know, totally. Extra processing power hopefully starts going into stuff other than just graphics. And fire extinguishers. Um, of course, AI is such a hard problem. I think a lot of that work has to happen on the conceptual level, right? I guess, it's yeah. Not, it's mean, not necessarily it's, just needing well, more horsepower. It's also just knowing what to do or how to design it, you know? Guy still seeing it? No. Okay. So that's the thing we're actually here to do, so I'm just going to do it. Oh, jeez. They have other ideas. Yeah, they do. And that went bad for me for a lot of reasons. Yeah, at some point, too, you need to make the game fun, right? If you make your AI too good. No, I'm not saying make it too good. No, because making AI too good is a very easy thing to do. There's the slow-mo off the adrenaline. Making it realistically good is, is a much harder problem. Like, you could just make it so they get perfect headshots as soon as they see you, you know? That's 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 Call of Duty veteran or whatever. That's well, not, I, I guess that's right. I, that's not fun. But I, that's, I guess I meant more like they would stay in cover and never just come out. You'd always yeah, just have Yeah, yeah, sure. Well, I'm not saying make it 100% realistic, but... Yeah, yeah. you got to find a balance. Yeah, make balance. It, but make it behave Between more naturally. Like believable behaviors. <laughs> yes. And a dude running into a wall. Yeah. Well, you know, that's always the way is that they have the, the advantage of numbers. So you have to... They have to compensate on your, on your end somehow. All right, we're going to run past this gun again. Do it. Ah, we could have shot out that camera, and it probably would have been a different story. But look, I got places to be. I blow up those turrets when I played this part. I'm a shadow marshal. Marshal? Marshal. Marshal shadow. Marshals matter. Now you're doing your regular objective? Yeah. Wait, go back. Behind you. Look at that wall. This wall? No, the other one. To your left, 180 degrees. Turn, keep turning. Look up, back, right. What the fuck are you doing? That? that? No, what is that? I don't know. What is that? It's a painting. I'm not it's sure a, what that it's is. It's a shadow map. Maybe yeah. Is that just a weird looking shadow? No, it's probably just some junk on the wall. I, all right. Something right? I, yeah, I don't know. Stuck out to me. That looks better on the Xbox One. <laughs> <laughs> well, they're pushing way fewer pixels, you know. Hey, walk near my C4. Okay. Oh, oh that's a lot it. of guys. <laughs> oh, here they come. Did you detonate it? Yes. I did. I just... Also, they've set off an alarm. Get your owl out there. Get some owl time. All right. Yeah. Owl time. Yep, that's right. Turn your back to yeah, the guy with exactly. the assault rifle. Oh, he's getting pestered by an owl. Yeah. Can't shoot helmets off anymore, or they're just not really the helmets you would shoot off anymore. Yeah, they don't really wear those little. Uh... Oh, there's a vent. I'm yeah, I sure. think that goes back the way a, a, a different. Uh, we don't want to go that way. Mm. Wow. Right. Stop. Shut that thing up. So that's a camera. Now they'll never know you were here. Well, it's more that there's a turret that pops up if that thing sees you, so. Can you use the turret? Can you hack turret? No, uh, no, I don't think so. Shouldn't they just make the turret pop up by default if the camera explodes? That would be probably pretty smart. You know, there's a reason the hell gas lost that war, <laughs> all right? Fair enough. Whoa, that looks cool. A lot of three-fingered doors in this game. Mm. 
changed. But yeah, you know, you, you go on from here, you, you kind of, yeah. you know, it, it continues along this pace. You get to a point where the story starts to get interesting, and, and that's uh, the stuff that, you know, the, the later game stuff that we're not going to show here. But uh, haven't seen the multiplayer. We'll have to take a look at that on uh, on launch day. Yeah, I guess we'll jump into that during our stream, right? Yeah, yeah. Hopefully it'll all work. A couple days from now. I guess, right? But uh, look at that. Yeah, three fingered oh. doors. That does look all neat. over the place. That does look neat. Why are they letting you in? Stab him. Uh, yeah, that's a, Stab another him. great question. Look how much taller he is than you. Well, that's why I'm a shadow marshal. I'm the stealth guy. I'm the little stealth man. Uh, all right. Well, thanks, Jeff. Thanks, Jeff. That guy's uh, gonna see that body. And... Check back in a couple days for more PS4 launch stuff. Yeah. More kill zone. Zone. 